welcome back to what I suspect will probably be the last episode of Inside. Uh, I feel like we're getting close to a climax here, even though, um, you know, really just wish I knew more about the world and why. Are we going to kill ourselves right here? Already? It's not going to be much of an episode. No. Alright. Then, what are we doing? Wait. That can't not... That can't be it, right? I've... I've... I have fit through smaller places. Maybe I'm just not supposed to go in there. Or maybe I gotta put something else in there. This box? Yeah. Sure. Hmm. Maybe. I mean... I don't know what's in it, but... Oh! It's on fire. I take it back. Oh, that sucks. I have, have to throw it over? I think I have to throw it over the sprinkler system there. Clever, clever mechanic. I like, I like. Yeah, whatever this is. Groaning and moaning all the way up. And all the way back down. Huh. Pick it up. This is pretty absurd. I like it. I like it a lot. Hmm. That's not what I was supposed to do. Wait, should I pull down on the handle? I should have to climb on top of it. Alright, hold on. Alright, put it down. Because the handle always lands on top. Well, K. 
Can I pull the handle or not? Handle always comes out on top. Yeah. Don't you do it? Okay, you pull it. You guys pull it. Yeah. All right. Nice. Oh, missed the timing. Don't worry, I got it this time. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> Feels like a trap. Don't like it. And this is a wall. Damn. What are these people doing? It's like they set this up to happen. So I'm supposed to fall through the... Yep. Yep. Doesn't game over me, does it? No. Okay. Yeah, it's Take the west part. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. What is this all ultimately leading to then? What does it all mean? Tell me what it means. Ugh. Okay. <laughs> oh, shit. Oh, God, but this is the end right here.
Eh. I'm suspecting that's it. I'm suspecting that's the end of the game right there. So, yep. That's it. Wow. Um... Hmm. Well, it's good. It's a good game. It is a game. And it's good. <laughs> and I don't think it would help. I don't think it would help the game to add more exposition or story to it. I think it would actually be worse for the game. But at the same time, I'm left wanting for more story, explanation, lore, something. Even though that would detract from what I think the game is trying to go for, I think I would still, still like some more. I mean, it's, there's definitely a story in there, but you have to make it up yourself, I think. Um, even if they were going for something, there's a lot, a lot of different ways you could interpret the way the game went. I mean, I don't know. It's... Huh? That was it. Um... Hmm. Well... I don't know. I would. I didn't expect to finish this and think it was ev gonna be even more ambiguous than Limbo was. I mean, Limbo was just like you found. In case I mean, I don't want to spoil it, but you find another character, and it's kind of left up to your own interpretation what that character means. To you or the the character you play as, but in this, it's it's even more up to interpretation. I mean, this world they've made clearly has problems, but I don't know. It's it seems like they could have like I said I don't, I don't know if I don't think that adding more story to it would benefit it in any way but at the same time I really want to know more what they had in mind for what the story about this place was it was interesting though I definitely enjoyed it animation is great colors are beautiful uh, the gra I mean, everything about it's beautiful. You could take any any frame of this game and and frame it and put it up on your wall. I mean, it's just it's a gorgeous game. Animation was great. Sound was great. Man, I just wish there was a little bit, just a little tidbit. I don't know, maybe they, maybe they would explain it in some other form of media, maybe on their website or something, but I doubt it. I doubt they would. I, this doesn't seem like the type of thing that they would reveal anything more about what they were going for. I mean, they're hurting people like cattle. They control their minds. There's underwater people. 
and then there's experiments some some I, I, I assume some kind of experiments going on with people's bodies and turns them into amorphous blobs for some reason which I like I like all those elements I mean it's it's post-apocalyptic and it's sci-fi I don't know interesting though I'll get, I think I'll probably give it a couple months and play it by myself again. It I don't think it was as difficult as Limbo. I think Limbo had more puzzles to it. It was just more puzzle dense. And Limbo had, I think, more enemies. I mean, spider, giant spider, and environment wise definitely had more traps and things that could kill you huh but this is more environment centric I think even though Limbo had you know great environment but it was more flat I feel where this is has more depth to it at least art style wise not really gameplay wise it's about, about the same depth gameplay wise mechanical wise with a few extra additions like the, the blob definitely added something to it Really interesting, though. Really interesting. Hmm. Well, I liked it. I did. Just, man, would love some more... Some more about the story. I think it would be really, really cool... To get a, a better sense of what this world was... Like, what the developers were... Trying to go for, uh, as far as where they got different ideas for what parts and how they kind of saw it meshing together for themselves or for the game like how the developers saw the game meshing together I think it would be cool to To ask them what what they were really going for and what uh, what the world they envisioned was really like and where I don't know what happened to make it like this. I think it'd be really cool. Beautiful game though, and uh, it was fun. It was fun. Well, I guess that's it. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, more games to come. I hope you enjoyed this uh, this game as much as I did. Uh, really interesting, really interesting, and, uh, well, I was going to say good vibes, but not, not really a good vibey game, kind of a sad, depressing ending, maybe, I mean, they get free of the place, but then what, then what happens, kind of anticlimactic, really, Huh. Weird. Weird, right? Well, anyway. Thanks again for watching. This has been Dark Sevenfold, and I will catch you later.